<laughs> oh, you puppets. You puppets. Predictable. Predictable. I tell you what, I'm going to throw something at you just so you be cringe like the usual self. I did this just for the kicks. Oh, so real. Oh, you eat so unhealthy. Now, where do your health is going down at? Oh, looky here, Taco Bell. And looky here, I got a soda. <laughs> Uh, literally bought just just the fucking you delusion losers can crave on to. But the facts is, the facts is, I tell you later. I'm going to take a few bites of my burrito. Hold on, I want to eat the taco first. Let me eat the taco first. This was free. It's a four dollar taco. It's uh what was it? Fire tier um uh, I can't remember the word. Fire it's a fire tier reward for you know earning coins and but do you see it? No, it's just got the, it's got the soft taco shell and it's got the hard taco shell. See, I fuck. I go ahead and go to. Y'all want to believe? I already knew. I already knew how what why I got uh, so right uh, my liver, sir. <laughs> Whatever. I already knew why I got it. And too bad puppets, it ain't because of this. See, there's two things protecting y'all from the truth. You're trying to do, avoid the truth. <clears throat> the reason why I got that Is because the same reason why I got all, uh, same reason why I got this heart damage. And again, heart damage, not due to this. I got three, three things about my heart. One is genetics. Uh, inherited kind of thing where my heart one side of my heart is thicker than normal the other thing is electrical issue that's um just something that's wrong with it i guess i mean it could be because of the damage also as well but there's damage on a uh, on the side of my heart and why, what caused the damage? What have I been saying the damage was when I was doing and talking about it? Due to uh, me overdosing, trying to overdose on pills. Now, that's the first factor that you're in denial about. For two reasons. You need me to, you need to paint me as the slob you want me to be, as someone declared me to be, because I wouldn't give him what he wanted. I, I, I choose to be defiant.
So that's the first defense that y'all won't believe the truth. That you already know the truth. You know what caused it. Mick taking over jokes, overdoses years ago. And what was the other factor? What, what, was, what would be the other factor that's you being defensive of or being denial about and being other than what you want it to be? Oh yeah, because why did I commit the, why did I was trying to overdose? I was married. I was married, so given that fact, you want to be in denial of that because it is, it will, it's a, to most people, especially losers like yourself, it's something you're not going to ever attain. And it's a goalpost to hold over someone that you consider a loser when you're the only loser around. And if by some miracle that you, you are to say you are married, that you either married to a loser that's no not for just as bad as you, absolutely just as bad as you, because anybody in life wouldn't marry someone. <laughs> that draws closures and, and acts the way you do. Unless they are just as bad. In other words, their expectations was low. Especially given the fact that I was I was married, it's obviously I'm not a virgin. You are. And again, anybody anybody with a life would agree with me. <clears throat> People watch my videos with a, without the low expectations of like yourself would see that I'm I'm outgoing. Like I made those girls, those women laugh on that VR game. I'm not, I'm not a shut-in. Unlike you know a certain someone is. I'm not. Uh, socially scorned to be upset when someone doesn't thank me when I open a door for them. And most certainly, I'm not the one kind of person that would question someone on Twitter about them dating or seeing two women at a time, proving that I don't have, I've never had that activity or I've had activity at all, to be questioning someone about that to a point it leads up to. <laughs> an online beef that's mostly one-sided to where he subscribes to another individual to influence to get, to get what he wants and and then go and doesn't do doesn't get so then goes to a, a, a greater measure of meeting another person over the internet and and Meeting someone 
another person over the over the influence of another one to look for an, an emotional reaction when you're the one showing all the emotional actions to do to look uh, another man that meets another man in the real has never been laid. Again, I say it. Another man that meets another man over the internet due to due to over another a third individual to look for a reaction <laughs> has never been laid. But uh, and anybody with a life would agree with me. Ah, again, y'all, y'all losers. And here, let, here, here, before I forget about it, it just came up to my mind. Let me prove it. I've done this before. I, I, I let's say y'all would be this way in behalf of someone else, and I, I, I pointed out, I totally brung out a contradiction. Let me, let me prove to you. Let me prove to you that y'all are not credible. Y'all are not reliable. Y'all have no. leg to stand on. I was mocking El Presidor, which I was telling all truth. Anybody with a life would agree with me. Condition, within the conditions of buying a one cup coffee maker. Anybody would agree with a, me stating that it would be less effort in making the one cup of coffee within the cup without you without spending money and taking up time using that coffee maker, one cup coffee maker. Anybody would agree with me with the fact that y'all, the way y'all do and y'all actions and stuff involving shit that I buy and spend. So what, what, would, what would be a great example that I could bring up? What would be a great example let me let me tell you. Let's see what. Let me prove it's def mostly in defense of a certain someone. Ah! Wait, wait, wait! I got a perfect example. And how, I, how I, ironic that is, that I could come up with examples to expose y'all and not only de demolish y'all credibility, but also damage his. I shouldn't be able to damage his credibility because he shouldn't make examples. He shouldn't take actions that, that does so. And I shouldn't be smart enough to realize them, but yet I am. So what, what, what example am I talking about? Where I'm going to bring up. Did not, did he not, I deber, <laughs> deliberately created bait for him. And that's also the irony of it. I created the bait for him to do so. I recorded that video of me buying that one-up uh, one arcade game, Galica. Me playing it with one hand, and I literally called out, El Presidor, don't get jealous. What, it didn't, it, was it five days after that he made a video? Nope. Was it four days after that he made a video? Nope. Was it two days after that he made a video? Nope. It was right after. Well, so real, where's the contradiction? 
I don't see no contradiction. I don't see nothing, you know. Yeah, it is. There's a contradiction. He questions and judges a, a, an item I buy, which, did he have any rightful judgment against it? No. Did I have a rightful judgment over that coffee maker? Yes. No one buys a coffee maker for their home. A single cup coffee maker for their home. It's like I said, you even see them in a hotel. Sometimes hotels provide coffee makers. And how many cups does it make? One. Just like I said, most people buy, goes out on a vacation trip. And if their hotel doesn't provide a coffee maker, what do they go do? They go buy a one cup coffee maker. They do. My dad goes camping. What does he take with him? A one cup coffee. He, 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 don't, he don't even take it back in his house. He leaves it in the camper. And he goes fam, camping with other family members. What, what do they got? A one cup coffee maker. A one cup coffee maker is a convenient, cheap product to buy. It costs at most $15 to, uh, for not for your home daily use. Especially when you know you drink more than one cup. Now, has he ever admitted that he drinks more than one cup? He has drunk more than one cup on stream. <laughs> there you go, so real. How'd you come by that information, so real? How you how you come by that information so real? You must be watching his streams. What well, well, didn't I just say that I made a video with an arcade, me buying, showing I purchased an arcade game, and me calling him out to make a video for me, questioning, literally wanting him to question the arcade and me buying it when he wasn't going to have no ju true just just questions of me doing so. But let's get back. Let's get back to the point. So, he made a video. What did he talk about, my arcade? He questioned the logic of me buying that arcade game, given the fact it was a display model. A display model. A person with a life outside losers like you. not going to have no rebuttal rebuttal against this that's not going to have nothing to refute this and does it not and has, has no way of saying that I don't get a W from it so he questioned me buying that arcade game because it was a display model sure it had wear and tear on the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, arcade game, the, uh, the pictures on the, the, uh, board and stuff where people rubbed it and rubbed it out. But did I not get a replacement? Yes, I got a free, free of charge. I not only got a, a, a decal replacement for that arcade board of where the buttons and stuff is. I also got a plastic guard, a clear see-through plastic guard to put over the new decals, pictures of that arcade game, where it would never wear out again, free of charge. 
So, and it looks brand new. It, look, it still looks brand new, and it's uh, it definitely looked brand new then. So, no rightful judgment on me buying that display model. Wait a minute. Well, still, where's the contradiction? Where's the contradiction? He was talking about uh, fucking germs and bugs and shit, you know, people touching it. It's fucking King rebuttaled on that and said, so what? It's not like a, a, a fucking spray of fucking Windex. <laughs> it's a spray of Windex. Wiping it off and it's good to go. <laughs> but here's the kicker. Where's the contradiction? Wasn't that the motherfucker that bought a display model of a vacuum cleaner? Not too long before. Yeah, I remember. Yes, I do remember him when he was in a in a a, a fucking vacuum phase, constantly making videos of vacuums of him buying that model and that model. Did he not say one time that he bought a display model? See, can't handle it. Can't handle the truth. Probably seen where I was going, so the view count's going down. Thank it. The person that wouldn't tell you a lie constantly tells you lies. Who, who would have thank it? The person that really claims victory has got act, has made actions the other person to do, take such actions as begging and bribing to get what he wants by doing something that would be considered flattery is hinting that you he would sub to my channel by subbing to someone else's within a specific set, uh, specific set of time he would set, sub to mine instead but if not, within that time, he was up to that other person. Like, I would want that so much, I would have to do it before he does this for someone else. <laughs> oh, is he doing that for the guy he's are saying he's going to sub to and there's something to happen? Or is he really doing that because, because he wants something from that other person? And... What would anybody with a life would say? What what would anybody with a life would say? That it, what, what kind of backfire is that? <laughs> and then go to meeting that person. Then, oh yeah, what about lying about receiving messages? And here's the kicker about that. Here's the big kicker about that. Why did he admit to lying? Because maybe the truth was it the the truth is actually worse is actually worse than admit him that he's lying lied about that information. But what could possibly him lying and even coming out to lie? That's damning that I got the better of him. So what kind of other situation could it be make worse than that being a total W for me? Oh, oh yeah. He actually did receive messages, but not from me, from a troll. So not only he got he sped out 
that I got the better of him by admitting a lie. But also, he couldn't admit that I was played by someone else to think I was receiving messages. So I was, I, I it was a double whammy. Oh, I just love it. But, um, what would be <laughs> what? But, um, <laughs> oh, get mad, get mad, be mad. Astonish me. Vindicate me. Put more emphasis in my, my words to be the truth. Now, Like I said, that uh, issue, the cirrhosis, isn't due to un hell. Y'all want to believe I eat out all the time? I eat. I do Meals on Wheels. I volunteer for Meals on Wheels every day, but the weekend they're not open on the weekend. So I, I don't, I don't get paid for it. I give, I volunteer my time for it. I volunteer, I, I spend my money putting gas in my truck to do, do the deliveries, and I do other things whenever they're short people. I help prepare the food and stuff. So, the only thing I get for it is I get a plate of food for that day for me to eat. And that's what I eat mostly. That's what I eat mostly. So every day, one, five days a week, I, I get a plate of food of Mills and Wheels. And how, that food is fixed in generally for old people. It's fixed and prepared to be healthy for old people. So you know it's going to be it's not going to be the greatest tasting food. It's going to be, stuff is going to be, you know, fixed a certain way where... <laughs> oh, man. So I, I'm eating more healthy than you are with just that simple fact of one meal a day a week. Like I said, I only bought this. I only bought this just because, <laughs> just to have y'all going, unhealthy, 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 unhealthy. Y'all don't have no law, you don't have no credibility. The day that I walked that trail, is it, was it my last time I walked? No, you don't get, you don't get, I don't live stream every walk. I don't record videos every time I walk. I don't post on the community board of the stats of how many. Sometimes I don't. I forget to activate that app, and I just go out there to walk. Sometimes I got Jerry with me. Sometimes I don't got Jerry with me. Sometimes I'll go home, but then go out back out walk and take Jerry with me. Sometimes I get done with the meals on wheels. I don't want. I don't feel like. I feel like. I push myself. I feel like if I go home, 
I feel like I'll find an excuse to not go back out. So I push myself. I push myself. I won't go home. I'll park immediately and I'll start walking. And y'all's judgments on my walking <laughs> is just as credible as y'all's judgments on my truck. It's just as credible as the judgments on my fucking water I drink. Uh, my doctor, my doctor drinks the same water that I do. And matter of fact, I turned him to it. He never heard of it. I took one to him and, and got one to him for him to try. He likes it. He drinks it now. He might not drink it as much as me, but that's just, he, he agrees that it is good. So y'all judge it. <laughs> y'all arguing. Y'all want to believe the bad, the, the stuff like that. But my own doctor is mocking y'all, laughing y'all in the background. He knows about my YouTube channel. <laughs> he, he, matter of fact, he likes it that I post, that I keep a track of my majority of my walking and live streams and the, the stats I put because that is nothing but a constant motivation, a constant looking and say, I'm keeping a track of this and I, it builds a, uh, it helps me keep going and keep doing it and keep keeping a record of it. And he, 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 he so he approves of the water. He, he def, I, when I showed him the last, I told you when I walked that trail, go back and watch it. When I'm starting to walk, from that that, uh, that long part of the path to get to Columbia State. I literally said I had a doctor's appointment. I literally had, I said I had a doctor's appointment that I needed to get done to and go to. I showed him those stats that I made that day that I posted on my community board. His eyes went, whoop. He, I told him I walked the trail but I never showed him, you know. He said, James, this is a, amazing. I have another patient that I wish that I could get him to do something similar to this. I know he can't do that much. There's no way he can walk for three hours, but I would love to at least get him out there for at most 20 minutes. But you did, you walked for three hours and he looked at all the stats. He said it was, it was amazing. He, he, he told me to keep it up. You puppets are, you are the losers that can't leave y'all's basement. <laughs> Due to the mental, mental issues that y'all, you can't leave the basement because you might miss a live stream that I might do. <laughs> you you can't leave in front of your computer. You can't leave. You can't. <laughs> Just so you might miss out on something I might make you dance, which I am making you dance. And uh, uh, what was it? Uh, last week, Tuesday, last week's Tuesday, I got another compliment on my truck. It wasn't a straightforward compliment, like, hey man, nice truck. Um, it was a, um, I was going to do some laundry and there was this, this young, not young, young, but young, probably in her 29s, 28, 29. I don't think 27, but maybe. But this young, beautiful woman, beautiful woman. I've talked to her maybe two or three times beforehand. And uh, so I've, I've generally have, I've had conversations in the laundromat with her, the laundry room. 
because she's a uh, what are they called nurse aid she goes to people there that that's having mobile trouble because or maybe because they injured or you know just you know generally helping people that's has a hard time doing things so and I she is beautiful Whew, and every time I flirt with her as much as I could as much as I can and uh, but I shouldn't do it she's married she's freshly newly married she hasn't even been married a year yet so I'm throwing compliments at her and uh, I'm talking to her and I've never talked about my truck to her. I, as far as I knew, she didn't know what kind of vehicle I had or if I even had a vehicle. And it just never came up. We talked about a lot of other shit. But when I, I, I had no idea she knew about my truck. I guess she, maybe she seen me. And she told me she seen me. When, I, when she brung it up, I said, maybe she seen me get in it. But she said, that's a nice truck you got. Uh, and I said, yeah, <laughs> I've had a lot of offers for it. And uh, I've even had people chase me down and follow me to wait and wait till I stop to ask me about it and question me about it. And she says, you know why, don't you? I said, yeah. You puppets, <laughs> you never know why. You never know why because you never know, you never have anything nice you would never have anything popular or highly desirable but especially your life <laughs> it would be desirable by <laughs> desired by anybody and here's a kicker you're it's not even desirable by yourself for yourself you don't even desire your life for yourself That's the reason why you're here. Expect, uh, stand in the shadow of mine. Uh, you put false images in front of you when you watch me. Saying the, say, saying the shit that only could be said to you and directed towards you but you just don't got it in you to face the facts for yourself against yourself so for you to be in denial about yourself you you, you betray what you see here <laughs> and lie to yourself and saying it's worse than your outcome that's the only worst outcome, is you. The undesirable outcome. <laughs> Bottom line. Like I said in the last stream, ending it. No matter what happens to me, I have nothing to nothing to dread, nothing to regret. As long as I have the example of you in front of me, to know no matter what happens to me, I can get the worstest, worst. Cancers, illnesses, and I could be plagued with them all at once. And it would be, it would still be a better outcome to be than be you. Especially be a certain cat man. <laughs> 
So, in spite of that fact, you will continue to yield to my will, bitches. Now that's so real. 